Hi everyone, this is Patrick from Dutchie Tech Tips and in this video I am going to show you how to turn off the Windows Update Service in Windows 10. To learn how, right here, right now, don't go anywhere. Before we start messing around with Windows services in Windows 10, there's a little thing that I need to get off my chest. And is why do we need to turn off the Windows Update Service, you may ask. Well, because Windows 10 forces updates onto your computer, if you're not already aware of that. Unlike Windows 7 or 8.1, you had the choice of installing updates, and this is not the case in Windows 10. However, the Home Edition users of Windows 10 sort of get a little bit stuck of choosing which updates you want to install on your computer and can be really disastrous for your computer. But unfortunately, the Pro and Enterprise Edition doesn't offer the same sort of functionality as your home users. And this is where turning off the Windows Update Service comes in. Now if you're relying on the Windows Defender this will also affect this as we turn off the Windows Update service because it is sort of tied into it. Now if you're using Windows Defender then you're better out of luck unless you have another antivirus application. Now to turn off the Windows Update service we need to access our control panel which I have on my desktop. Now if you don't have the control panel, you can search for it by in your start menu by typing control panel, which the best match will show up here. So I'm going to open up my control panel. You're required to have administrative privileges on the computer to perform this function. If you have the privileges, we need to go to the administrative tools in the control panel. Now if you don't see the administrative tools icon, you may want to change the view to large icons instead of having it on category. This will open up the administrative tools window and we want to select services with the little gears. As you can see that the Windows services window has appeared and we need to scroll down to where it says Windows update service. So I'm using a shortcut key for by typing W and Windows updates is right here and as you can see if I click on it it will give us a description of what the service entails. It says enable the detection, download and installation of updates for Windows and other programs e.g. Windows Defender or previously known as Microsoft Security Essentials. If this service is disabled users of this computer will not be able to use Windows Update or its automatic updating feature and the programs will not be able to use the Windows Update Agent. To do this, we need to stop the service by right clicking on it and a context menu will appear and we want to select Stop. And as you can see, we have stopped the service and now we want to stop it from running again when the next time the computer starts up again, we go right click, Properties which will bring up a window and we want to select a startup type of disabled, click apply, click OK and as you can see that the service is now disabled. To summarize the key points of this video, one, I have explained why we have to turn off the Windows Update service, two, it's not mandatory to turn off the Windows Update service, but it's a user preference if you don't want force Windows updates. And three, I've shown you how easy it is to turn off the Windows Update service in Windows 10.